Hi everyone, Mona here from the Wig Fairy Salon. Welcome back. Today I'm going to go over our Wig Fairy Powder, the white color. Um, I have made other videos over the different colors that we use, but this particular one is a bit different. This is meant for your actual wig. So the great part about it is a lot of times scalps um, are darker or a lot of times the lace doesn't match your own skin tone and a lot of people are using concealers that are different shades, which the problem with that is it's leaving a lot of built up and it's making your wigs having to be washed or the color not matching your actual skin tone. So I've created a perfect fairy powder that is going to make your hairline super natural. So I'm going to walk you guys through how to use the wig fairy powder. This current piece is a raw piece, as you can see the lace here. Um, what I'm going to use the powder for is to blend the lace with the skin top. A lot of time, a lace front or a lace top wig will look dark, whether it's sitting on your hair or whether it's sitting on your skin. So what I'm gonna do is show you guys how to blend it and make it look more natural. So you always wanna place it on your head when you're doing this, and you want to have it where the part is going to be. I tend to use an angle brush. I like ones that has uh, the brush at the end. In case I ever get too much on it, I like to comb it out with this. So you're going to take your Wick Fairy powder. I'm currently using the white powder. And I like to start where the actual two pieces meet. If you don't have a piece that is a deep lace and it's just the lace top and you wanna cover it, then you could just start from the beginning of the hairline and continue back. I like carrying the color over to the back because sometimes wigs are a little bit darker in the back and not the same color in the front. So if you want it to look like a nice, clean, smooth line, I would recommend going all the way through with the powder. At this point, the hair over here, since the lace hasn't been cut, I'm gonna get a little extra powder and this is where I like to go in with my brush and comb out any extra powder that I don't want. And as you can see, the scalp has a straight line going through. I normally like my wigs a little bit zigzag. I don't like them where they're perfectly straight. It looks too perfect. So if you like it, then obviously take the hair and part it wherever you like. And at that point, you'll use the white powder and have it going across. If you enjoyed the video, the Wake Fairy Powder can be purchased online or at our store location. The white powder is used for your scalp. They do come in a variety of colors. If you're having hair thinning, make sure to look at all the different colors that we do offer. We'll create more videos for you guys. Stay tuned. See you guys later.